Welcome back. So we're still in Arch Dragon Peak here, and I wanted to show you this area uh, for a couple of reasons. Uh, first of all, there's one of those guys that summons up the uh, champions. Um, so this is past the second wyvern that we even encountered. Um, so you're gonna just run a run in. He's gonna summon Ricard uh, from Dark Souls One that you get the Ricard's rapier from. So he's gonna summon him. So you just gonna want to kill him and then kill Ricard. Uh, he's basically naked. So I mean, it's outside of getting you know stabbed to death by his rapier, you should be okay. Anyway, you, you want to run on him in here, grab this. Uh, I mean, actually, you could just run past him, grab this, and then attack him from behind if you wanted to. But the point being, there are a bunch of those little snake guys. There's like probably five or six of them down there, as well as three big guys. Two of them with the axe, the big axes, and then one with the axe that's on a chain that, you know, the problem with that is that that really goes through everything. It clips through walls. So, um, you know, don't think that you can, you know, just hide from him. Uh, what I like to do when I'm here... Is I like to get up here and snipe them with a bow. You can get these guys. Um, I basically just kind of stand right here against this pillar. Um, you know, I start. There's a guy over here that I'll snipe. There's a guy walking down here that I'll snipe. There's a guy right up there where my head is at on this kind of walkway area. And once you start sniping this one, then several more of the smaller guys and the three big guys start coming down. Uh, and you're fine to just snipe at them from here. Um, because what they will do is they will walk over to here and try and come up. But because, I guess because I'm standing here against here, they never see me. So they never actually cross the threshold here to come after me. So you may see them periodically walking up to here and then walking back down. But you should be totally fine. Um... The only problem you may have is when uh, the guy with the uh, axe on the chain that will just go through walls, uh, if he is uh, down in this area here, you probably don't want to... Sh I would not suggest shooting him because he will just turn and throw that thing at you. Um, but if you can just wait, he'll start walking on back uh, and then get him hit a few more times. And he will start walking this way, and then you're good. Because once he starts trying to get up this, uh, you can just snipe him, and he's dead. But the reason why you want to do all that, long story short, is there's some good stuff over here. So let me show you where it's at. Also, if you ever want to kill one of those little rock tadpole-looking guys, shoot him with an arrow. He's right there. He will just walk on off to his death. Uh, by the way... Also, up there, up that ladder, that's where you go to fight uh, Havel. Havel is up there. So if you want Havel's armor set, you need to fight Havel and then go back to uh, the uh, the swamp area near Farron Keep. And there's a tower that you can climb up that he's at. But So the two things you want to look at here first... Anytime you see a bunch of dragons and a table, you want to run up here, stop, and you want to do path of the dragon gesture. Anytime you see this, so there's a couple other spots in this area that you want to do this, and you get a, a torso stone essentially for it. So uh, if you want to be a dragon, definitely. Do Path of the Dragon in front of those tables and, you know, make yourself a dragon. But the real reason you want to come here is because there are uh, some ashes here off to the side. There's one of those rock guys right here, so be careful. Don't let him get you. And there is one hiding out right here. So just be careful about those guys. I find a jump attack, so like a, a running R2, boom, tends to work pretty well uh, on them takes a couple of times but you know it works pretty well on them but you want these ashes the dragon chasers ashes because those are going to give you all your end game uh upgrade materials you know you'll be able to turn those into the lady and firelink shrine and she'll be able to sell you dra you know titanite scale you know uh chunks 
you know, the only thing that she can't sell you as far as upgrade materials goes is the uh, Titanite slabs. So, but anything else, you know, I mean, that's, those are the ashes you want, and then you can just go and, uh, you know, farm some uh, souls and just upgrade to your heart's content. So anyway, I hope you found that useful. I hope you're having a great day. I uh, will talk to you soon. Bye for now.